I'm ready. I am so ready for Splatoon 3. The Splatoon 3 Splatfest has officially kicked off. Today you can download it on the eShop for free and get involved. Try out Splatoon 3 online with this Splatfest event and I'm definitely getting in that. But not on this Switch. Oh no, I'm going to be playing that in style with my brand new Nintendo Switch OLED. The Splatoon 3 Nintendo Switch OLED Limited Edition. And this is just such a beautiful looking system. And then on the back here, we have some artwork for the console as well. Very, very cool. This is gonna be, it's gonna be awesome. What a dear, what a dear. The Splatoon 3 Nintendo Switch OLED is here. And I'm gonna rock this as my main system. You ready? I'm not ready for this. I'm not ready for this. Cue the Legend of Zelda chest opening music, please. Here we go, here we go, first impressions, oh my goodness, this is, ooh, oh, those colours, that is fresh, that is nice, oh, these Joy-Cons, these Joy-Cons are something else, wow, okay, so we have, that's them in the packaging there, take this out, those are some nice Joy-Cons. These are some very, very, very nice Joy-Cons. Oh my dears, they are nice. That, oh, I don't know if you can do it justice in the camera, but you've got the two tones there on both, purple and blue on that one, and the, the green and yellow on that one. It's white on the back of these. You've got the artwork, the Splatoon artwork on there as well. One has the Oclings, one has the Inklings, but man, Nintendo has never done Joy-Cons like this before and that is why these Joy-Cons are oh, These Joy-Cons are fresh! Super fresh! Those are nice! It's a shame these aren't being sold separately Like the Splatoon 2 Joy-Cons where you have the neon pink and the neon green If you don't want to go out and buy a whole new Switch it would be nice just to get the Joy-Cons separately but I guess that would defeat the purpose of a limited edition system and this is very similar. Oh, let's check out the Switch itself. Let's check out the OLED. And oh, I know that I know that people say the OLED. It isn't a big upgrade. It's not the Pro. It's not needed. But once you see it in person, you'll realize that it's needed. It is needed. It is a big step up, especially the the OLED. The vibrancy of the screen. The colors just pop so much on the OLED. The screen's bigger. What does it look like? Tell me. Tell me what it looks like. Is it good? Is it good? Ooh, that is nice. Ooh, that is very nice. It's it's subtle, but it's effective. And depending on when the light shines on it, it's it's not massively noticeable until the light hits it in certain angles, and that really is what gives it that look. The Splatoon 3 artwork all over there. Let's try it with the Joy-Cons on. I bet this looks... This is going to look something. Oh, this is a look. This is... Oh, guys. Mm. This? This is a look. Look at that. Let's compare it to the, the Splatoon 2 Joy-Cons. It's just... Oh, it takes it to a whole new freaking level. Nintendo has never done Joy-Cons like this before. The green matches a bit. It's but oh, the two-tone green, man, that, that two-tone there, the green, the yellow, the purple, and the blue. You got the Oclings and the Inklings there, and the, the, the little subtle designs on the back, the tentacles there. It is just, this is better than I thought it would be. I almost didn't pick this up because I convinced myself that I didn't need it. Is this the same old? Yeah, the same old grip as usual. I don't know about you guys, but I never, ever, ever use these. I've never used these to this day, and I never will. But yeah, these have a custom design on too. Let's have a look at the dock now. This is probably one of the best parts. I don't know if I'm going to use the dock. I might stick to my, I just, my OLED white dock. I like this, but I mainly wanted it for the Joy-Cons. For the design on the Switch itself. Oh, there's the splat. No, 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 scratch that. Scratch all of that. I ain't using that. I'm upgrading because this is awesome. This is, oh, that looks fresh. That looks nice. That dock 
looks nice. That is a nice dock. We've got the the spot there as well, which is very, very bright and vibrant. It looks like your inkling has got a bit carried away there. But that is nice. That is very, very nice. Oh, I like the dock. I really, really... What a day. What a day. This is good. This is, this is nice. And there it is. In its dock. There's the dock with the splat there. Why do I get the feeling it might glow in the dock? Because that, that's, that's there. That's a splat. And that's, um... That's so vibrant as well. It, it looks like it could glow in the dark. I could be wrong. Nintendo seems to be really going down. I'm going to need to sync everything across from my other Switch. That'll take me a good while to do before I jump onto the Splatfest. But when I do jump onto the Splatfest later on today, I am doing it in style. I am all Splatoon 3 ready with my Splatoon 3 limited edition OLED. I've even pre-ordered the Pro Controller. This is the Splatoon 2 Pro Controller. But with any new console, even if it's a different variant of the same console I already have, I do like to get a launch title for that. Just to make it feel like a new system with a new game to play. And that game is Pac-Man World Repack. Brilliant, brilliant, phenomenal platformer back in the day on the PlayStation 1. What a day, what a, what a weekend it's going to be. Nintendo, they've done it again with the Splatoon 3 OLED. Convinced myself I didn't need it. Convinced myself I didn't like the dock at all. I'm just going to stick to my white dock. But yeah, I'm changing the dock because this is, that is freaking awesome, this dock. I love the dock. I love this Switch. Life is good right now. Life is good. Anyways, guys, I'll see you next time.